What is going on everyone? Today, just cutting right to the point, you've probably heard, but Alpha 1 has been pushed back again, and this time with a July 9th pre-test date and a July 14th to August 13th Alpha 1 date. This, although disappointing, isn't really all that surprising, as this is part of the risk Intrepid takes with a transparent development cycle. But I personally would rather see the delays instead of the repercussions that would come with the Alpha if it didn't hold up to people's standards. Although it is an alpha, there will be tons of people out there that base their opinion on the game from the NDA drop, and if not in the right spot, could potentially hurt Ashes in the long run. But getting into why Alpha 1 was delayed, well it seems for a few reasons. The first being the Siege system and combat revamp. The Siege system is currently still in the bug testing phase and the combat revamp that was meant for Alpha 1 was delayed originally. But it sounds like with this delay, this is something that might actually make it into the game for the July launch now, which would be awesome to see. The Siege system itself we know is taken straight from the Apocalypse engine, but that mode never actually made it into the early access for the game, so there are probably a lot of kinks to work out still, and for something like Sieges, even in its early form, you'll want it functioning properly for the audiences watching. The other reasons that Steven gave is that there are several game expansions launching in that June timeframe, such as the Blackwood expansion for Elder Scrolls Online, and the big one, the Burning Crusade Classic. Classic is huge, and as much as people hate what Blizzard is doing with BC Classic, it is still going to have a huge launch and pull a huge part of the MMO crowd into streaming, playing, and watching that game, while potentially taking away from those who would be streaming or creating content for Ashes of Creation, and as Steven put it, they don't want to make the fans choose between playing one or the other. As Ashes is a long way out from launch, so it would make a lot of sense for a lot of players to put that on the back burner and get a jump into out lands with the Burning Crusade. But while this is an issue now, Intrepid will now have another beast to face with their July alpha testing date, as the New World Closed Beta drops on July 20th, six days after Alpha 1 kicks off, and will give the MMO community the first good look at the game since the year-long delay where Amazon Game Studios begun pumping out content based on fan feedback. As when Ashes finally comes out, it would not be surprising if New World is its strongest competitor. And it does look promising for an MMO. Anyways, getting back into Ashes, in the delay announcement we did get a bit more detail on what Intrepid will be looking at when it comes to the Alpha 1 testing, which will be things such as looking at the stress on the servers with high player volume, launching multiple world servers, testing the health of the server grid over continuous use, test build strategy and hotfix deployments, as well as the launcher and patcher stability, along with more core features within the actual game, such as node leveling and progression, making sure they advance correctly and hold experience from the players, player systems such as PvP flagging and corruption, death, inventory, character equipment, player storage, combat systems including both tab targeting and action combat, race and class selection, looting, party management, caravan, spawn rates, and a whole lot more. If you want to dive into this a bit more, the full article is in the description below for you to read. Anyways, what are your thoughts on the delay? Let me know in the comments down below, and if you are new to Ashes and have yet to make an account on the website, feel free to use the referral link in the description below. Otherwise, be sure to click that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, turn on the bell for notifications, and stay tuned for a lot more to come.